area. I'm from this area. I've been teaching in Georgetown County for 29 years, and I went to Kensington School, Beck Middle School, and graduated from Winyah High School, and attended Coastal Carolina and to receive my education degree. Um, I'm just here tonight not to complain or cause any problems, but I just wanted to be. Um, I just want to be proactive for my school. I have been there forever, um, it feels like, and we do great things at Plannersville. And I would love to see our school still be able to be open to honor the magnet program because our students have just flourished so much being a part of the digital immersion program. And it's just great to see the excitement, the collaboration, what they do together as um, peers and friends and they they are becoming great leaders and it would be great to see that continue I know we're a small school but we are growing and the previous superintendent had a mission to help get enrollment up by having the magnet school and I see it happening and I just wanted to mention that and say that great things are happening in the bill my name is Callie Holmes I am a third grader at Plansville Elementary Digital Immersion School. My school may be small, but it is full of dedicated teachers who are grooming future leaders. At Plansville Elementary, we conduct STEM projects, coding, just to name a few, just to name a couple. Just we use a coding program called Tinka for various activities. Please allow us to continue showing everyone else what my community already know, what we are capable of. Thank you for your time. My name is Isaiah Peoples. I am a fifth grader at Plansville Digital Emergency School. I would like for you to please reconsider not closing our school. We have made lots of changes over the past months. We do lots of coding, STEM to make learning fun. We also have the village youth that help us with our homework and the summer pro program that I look forward to every summer. My name is Zariah Lawrence and I'm a second grader at Plantersville Elementary. I really hope our school won't close because I love my teacher, Ms. Brandon. We work hard all day in class and during after school activities. Keeping classes open should be a priority for the Georgetown County School Board, recognizing we can we are only digital school in our county, preparing careers and college ready students at their early at an early age. Our smaller class size are essential for our student success, particularly for those that are struggling with learning. Research consistently shows that students in smaller class receive more individualized attention from their teachers. This is one on one support and crucial is crucial for students who may find certain subjects challenging. At Plowzo, Teachers can tailor their instructions to meet the unique needs of each student. Which class size, when class size a small student feel more comfortable participating in discussions, asking questions, and seeking help. Secondly, Plainsville Elementary School is not just any school, this is a digital emerging school. This, that means that students are immersed in technology-rich learning environments which prepare them for the future where digital literacy is essential. The skills students gain in Plainsville, such as coding, digital communication, and online collaboration are invaluable. Furthermore, the petitioners request that the Georgetown County School Board reconsider the decision to close Plainsville Elementary and instead allow for the recruitment of more students through a magnet grant, through this magnet grant. This grant provides an opportunity for the school to market a unique program and attract families who live not be aware of the benefits of a digital emergent education.